everybody welcome back to my channel so today we're going to be looking at the 2019 queen's christmas speech yes we're going back in time i've had a question from a subscriber asking me to have a look at this so i'm going to so the queen usually has and the king now will have pictures of family close family members to him on the table or to her and in the 2019 Christmas speech, while Harry and Meghan were in Canada for context, so pre-Mexit, um, she had Prince Philip, um, the Prince and Princess of Wales family at the time, and the King and Queen Consort. Pictures on the desk. So the question is, did this affect Mexit? Did this cause Mexit? So we're going to have a look and see how much and how much they felt about it. Um, we have got the Cosmic Coven Tarot, so we're going to be using that. And yeah, so just before I start, thank you very much to all my new subscribers. Welcome thank to everyone who's been here for a while. Thank you so much. I do appreciate you and to the emotional support, Coven. Thank you so much. I do appreciate you guys. So let us begin. So, how did Harry and Meghan feel about the 2019 Queen's speech? The High Priestess in reverse, they weren't happy with the Queen for this. They weren't happy with her. Do you know how they kind of framed it that she, in the... Um, in the Netflix documentary show thing type deal, that this was she had bad advice around her and she wasn't necessarily yeah yeah they weren't happy with the queen they don't want to come out and say they were unhappy with the queen what is crossing them they weren't front and center they wanted to be acknowledged they couldn't see themselves on that table and that knocked them knight of pentacles what's known about the situation well, Harry made some claims in the Netflix documentary and he was still a working royal at that time. He thought being technically the spare, he should have been on the table. They did think they were more, he did think they were more important than, it was seen as a snob basically. What's underneath the situation? The devil in reverse. So this is all about control. They weren't, they could not influence anymore the queen on how she perceived them and their place in the family. There was a protocol. They couldn't jump the queue. They didn't realize um, that they couldn't have necessarily their way. And it's very frustrating for them very frustrating they think they should have been front and center they thought they were the the rock stars as Piers Morgan said in the trailer of the royal family they thought they were they thought they were going to get some justice and be seen and be heard and it's like they wanted it's almost like when the public popularity waned against them they wanted they still wanted to be liked and loved and even in that instance, they think that they should, everyone should like them. If only we could see how lovely they truly are. And with that justice in reverse card, they think they need to have justice. But for what? What is the cause? What is going on? And then we have got the Ten of Cups. And then we have got the Hanged Man interesting and the two of swords they were looking from the outside and they could just see this kind of happy family and we have the hanged man there And they made the decision too quickly now. I mean, you can look back in retrospect at this. The hanged man in reverse. The hanged man in reverse. The hanged man upright and the devil in reverse. Two very quick decisions. 
the Empress in reverse, okay. And there we have the Eight of Wands. So let's talk about this. We have the Hanged Man and the decision to leave. I feel like they wanted to they wanted to show the world how happy they were as a little family unit. I feel like they were just wanting to be on the outside looking in. The hanged man there shows that they needed patience and to sit back and watch and wait for things. But we know with the two of swords pressing down that that wasn't good. The empress in reverse. What they were worried about and what they want to claim is something to do with um, ownership of Harry's mother's memory. They don't like the stuff that was written about Meghan in the press. They don't like the internet rumours regarding the moon bump. And they're very unhappy with that. What's annoyed them going forward and backwards and forwards. And I'm they're watching everything play out online. They're watching people arguing. They're watching things going backwards and forth. I don't know if they're joining in. It's a strong suspicion that they might be. Um, there's such things as people going on in sock accounts and doing things, but there's all this back and forth and all this noise. I really feel like they wanted to look like a happy family. They wanted to look like they wanted to lead. They thought they were doing better than everyone else. And then we have the Empress in reverse, which shows this kind of like, there is this, when the Empress is in reverse, there is this cruelty and there's gossip and there's backwards and forwards and all of those kinds of things. And that's what they really all were thinking of and thinking about what they were asked to do, what they were told to do was sit back and wait sit back and wait regarding everything and just let things play out everything will settle everything will calm down and it didn't and then they go straight into that i don't think from this cards the cards this is what caused harry and megan to leave the royal family i think this was a plan long before that um i was saying they were going to leave back in august 2019 if you're new here so i said they were going to leave in 2020 back then and they did and the reasons, I give the reasons why they were leaving and where they'd end up living, ish. I'm not that good on geography. I just said LA, California. I don't know everything. I'm not that great on it. I'm a tarot card reader. Um, so yes, there we go. Um, that's what I'm seeing there. I don't think, I think the photo caused anguish and hurt. And I think they feel like the Queen was controlled and made to do it. But at the end of the day, the Queen was in her 90s, but that doesn't just because you're in your 90s, it doesn't mean you haven't got all your faculties and don't know, know what's going on. I mean, my grand died when she was 99 and she was sharp as a button right to the end. So, yeah, there we go. That's what I think. Well, let me know what you guys think of the cards. If there's any readings you'd like me to do, leave them in the comments down below. I do appreciate you guys being here. Thank you very much for all of your support this year. Thank you for everything. Have a lovely Christmas and I shall see you in a little while. Bye, everyone.